but in your face, none your Ralph mail, not a bottom feed either. I'm the gray scale. Dear Aaron, there is a bond between us. In time, we've grown to know each other well. We have shared so much of our lives with each other, but we've drifted. We are not together. We are not whole. You know this. I could never really live in the city. Ever since an early age, I could always feel myself pulling away. There's something stiff in the air, everyone always walking in circles, looking like they taste cough syrup and everything. I remember the first time I saw a dollar bill, the first time I felt a coin in my hand, there was a coldness to it, and the faces on the bills, a chill in the weight of the metal in my hand. It took my heat, the warmth of my hand, to give it value, a value worth trading for life's essentials, food, shelter, warmth at night, but also other things, new essentials, automobiles, refrigerators, home insurance, television, Paxil, Zoloft, Wellbutrin, a second closet, a new house, a second life. The city's a rat maze with exit signs glaring red all around. It's hard to remember, but I remember you. With your help, I threw it off. Now I'm free. I quit my job and started reading full time at the library. I dreamt of places where value was in the action, not the price. Where victory was always in the attempt. I yearned for a freedom outside of shopping malls, a freedom I couldn't vote for. It didn't take long till I discovered what I needed. Money is not necessary for the gathering of life's essentials. It isn't where you look as much as how you look at it. Food is easily obtained from grocery storefronts, food courts, shallow dumpster dives. The gulls don't pay for food and they're still flying free. Sometimes I have enough to share. Sometimes I don't. I like to keep moving and not just because I love to travel. It's all free now. I can go anywhere. I can hitchhike. I can hide inside a flatbed. I can hop onto boxcars. And just watch the land pass away. Get a real sense of movement and the movement of life around you when you look out from inside a moving boxcar. Every little movement of the train you feel in your body, every little bump and grind. When I arrive, I immerse myself and observe. I don frightening costumes to fill my stomach and mind. I have a suit I picked out from behind Goodwill. It demands impeccable service from hotels and lets me eat, laugh, and applaud from my seat next to the food troughs at weddings. This pizza bag works like a ticket at stage doors. A pizza man is always welcome. Sometimes I feel invincible. A security guard is always needed at concerts or on set. Just a word on a shirt and a whole craft table to myself. I'm also a janitor, stock boy, orderly, construction worker. These characters help me survive. I keep them all here. This is where I live. The city supplies me with food, clothing, and shelter, all free of charge. It isn't much, but I don't want much. Just enough to live. Sometimes when I can't sleep, it gets so lonely here. But I always feel better when I think of you. We had such good times together, always helping each other and laughing. But you went away.
understood each other so well. I couldn't agree. I thought some of my methods were wrong. I guess you've already figured out why I'm writing you. I want to tell you and show you how much I've changed. I've seen and learned things here that give a new light to what I'm trying to do. Something's out of place in this world. It took me a little while to understand it, but it's here now. It's money. Money is the shit. The dirt under the nails. The whole concept is killing me. The math, the metaphor. I'm an animal. You and I are animals. And we don't need money to survive. I hope you can understand me. I need you to go on. I look forward to seeing you soon. Until then. things to find in a lunchbox. Worthless paper. Money. <sighs> Whose joke is this? Who's laughing at me right now? Should I take this trash and open a bank account? <laughs> Not likely. I know money. I know money. Although I wonder what's the value of this moment in this place with this how much can something like this hold? How rich am I right now? What, what would Aaron do with this? Would he take it? Would he start a new life with a new house and a new car? Would he have lots of friends? Would people like me? Hey. Aaron? Know thyself. Oh God, no, no. Ah! P.S. What happened to us? How could we drift so far apart? The cold, the cold. I feel it now, rejuvenating, understanding. I had forgotten about love, about the pain of loneliness. About you, Aaron. About us. You have it now. You have the gift, the warmth, the life. Take it from me. Yes. Take it from me. From the city. It's colder now. It's so cold. I can't get out anymore. I can't get out. But you can. You can. I know you will. I know. I know. Remember me. Goodbye. Love, Aaron. Thank you.